All y'all do is sit on this internet and judge people. At the end of the day, I did what I had to do as a mother. My kids should not go without living life because I can't afford to do something. Like earlier that week, my baby daddy had gave me like $300, but I had to get my hair and stuff done. It's only messed up now because I slept on it. I had to get my hair, lashes, nails and stuff done. So that's what I had to use the money from him for. My kids make good grades and everything is cool and they want to go to the fair and they deserved it. So I seen an opportunity with old dude, like, okay, he been in my inbox and stuff. He been begging me to go out to take me out and stuff like that. So I gave him my number, conversed with him a little bit. And I invited him out to the fair because I knew he was the type of person that was going to pay for it. So all I did was did what I had to do as a mama to make sure my kids can enjoy themselves. So I don't care how y'all look at me and how y'all judge me. I am a damn good mother. It's a lot of moms that wouldn't even do what I do to make my kids happy. I am a good mom. You know, like I don't want to do. I'm not attracted to him. I did what I had to do. All right, man. You already know, man. We can we can disagree, but let's get this conversation started. So as y'all heard in the video, uh, this young lady, I'm assuming she's a young lady, was justifying why she played this brother who she called a clown. Talk about she had to do it for her kids and I'm a good mother and y'all trying to judge me. And You know, let me, let, let me say this. Let me say this, sisters, for the ones who are listening. And brothers, man, please like and share this video and make sure y'all subscribe. Y'all wonder why a lot of brothers are saying, what, what's the point? What's the point? Why would I deal with a woman with her kids when I can get played like this? This is what people are saying. The kids are innocent. They don't have nothing to do with it. But here's the thing, right? Let's just say, because this may, she may just be trolling, but let's just say this is where you took it. You, you used the brother, right? Fine. You know, y'all know he wanted something. You didn't want to give it to him. You did what you had to do for your kids, but then you embarrass this man online, and then you mad at the backlash, talking about you a good mother. You can be a good mother and a bad person, you know, especially when it comes to dating in general. It, but it's weird because you hear women say, my kids are a package deal, and you know, you have to accept mine, and you're going to have to help me take care of these kids, you know, is is they're my kids when I try to punish them, but there are kids when it comes to people paying the bills. This is what brothers are saying, right? So you want all of that, but yet when you finally get a guy who wants to take you and your kids to the fair, you play him. But if you say your baby daddy, uh, you had to get your hair done. That's what made me think it's fake. But let's just say all that's all, all that's true. You had to go use a brother who liked you enough to take you and your kids. And you throw him to the side, clown him for the sake of your kids. See, what your kids is going to do is they're going to see that their mama ain't going to be able to get or keep a man more than a couple of nights. But we're the only group of people that, that, that do stuff like that. I just had an argument with a homeboy today about this stuff. It's not working. It's not working. And, you know, a lot of Gen Zers, especially people who be, who be on my on my channel, a lot of Gen Zers, a lot of millennials are saying, man, forget this. We, we're, not, we're not putting up with this. Why deal, why deal with this where you can go to DR, where you can go to Africa, where you can go to China, hell, where you can go across the street with Becky? You know, we live in a sick, twisted society. This is why I said the, the modern stepfather, honestly, he really, he really isn't valued like he was. 50, 60 years ago, she would have been honored for this man to take his hard-earned money and spend it on her and her kids. But now, he's an unattractive simp. But he was an unattractive simp when you needed his money. I really I, I really hope that the sisters will try to, will try to say that because we're the only ones who, I'm telling y'all, we're the only ones who's doing it. And she's going to be a product, more than likely, a product of being alone with grown kids. And that's fine. If that's what you want to do, but why? I don't know how many baby dads you got, but why one of them could have been your husband? Why he couldn't have took him and his kids to the fair? I mean, y'all should be able to co-parent, right? Why you not married to this man? You got kids with him, or how many baby daddies you got? Why you not married to none of them? See, and 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 it's people like her that ruins good sisters out there because brothers say, I mean, f it. What's the point? What's the point of dealing with this? You know, people, matter of fact, I never forget one time I went on a date with this one girl. And I had a feeling, brothers, y'all know what I'm talking about. Sometimes I feel like somebody might be using y'all. We was like, okay, let's go get something to eat. All right, whatever. When we go to the restaurant, she cuts the steak in half. Or it was a rib. Huge slab of ribs. But I'm like, why is she getting so much ribs? She cuts it in half, eats half of it, gets a to-go plate, and then says, calls her son and says, I got I got you some food. But then when we say, well, we're not going to deal with that, something wrong with me. I'm a weak man. I should. It's a package deal. But y'all don't want to ever set pack, packages that we come with. 
demands and stuff that we come with. So I'm not saying other women don't have their own sets of problems. Groups of people don't have their own sets of problems. This should be clear. If y'all didn't see this video, or if y'all sisters, if y'all don't see nothing, but we be talking about this video, I don't know what else to say, but this is, this is sad, 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 sad. This woman should be a wife somewhere, especially when you got kids. I gotta do what I gotta do for my kids. My kid, well, why you just can't get a you? Why you can't get a, get a better job and take them? Why you can't save up your man? Why you can't sacrifice your hair? Wear a bonnet. A lot of people be doing it anyway. Wear a bonnet. Do what you gotta do. You know how I many sacrifices I didn't have to make for my kids, and some of you brother had to make for your kids. You know, it's just sad, man. It's sad. But I just wanna get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.